it was like the price it cost. Yeah. My mother was like, uh, we don't we have that do kind that. of money. Right. Yes. Right. And she was like, um, so my mother told me, if you're willing to eat all your food at school, mm-hmm. I could take the grocery money. Wow. And I could get these, I could pay for the um, monthly classes. Uh-huh. I made the deal. Uh-huh. And that's how I knew that. Monday through Fridays, right. we was making eating. sure we eating good at school. At school, because moms is taking the grocery yeah. money right. and putting it towards your the acting active. classes. I got to that school, and the co- it was that school when mm-hmm. the teacher Joy Sylvester. I'm dropping names to give them credit. Absolutely, Joy Sylvester. I was only there a week when the color purple had this. They, they were going around having a cattle Castle call. call like, yeah. yeah. It was a cattle, cattle call. call. They put everybody. They, they went to every state. <clears throat> they kept looking for this one character. Mm-hmm. So I'm going to tr- make this go quicker. I'm not trying to. No, no, so, look. We got, we got a little time. <laughs> we okay. got a little time. Okay. Radio, okay. we going to cut it down. Okay. For here, we got some time. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> so what ended up happening was she submitted my pictures, mm-hmm. and they wanted to see me at an audition. Okay. I walked to the audition. And it was like 300 girls. Right. I was a, it was a long line. As soon as I got up on stage, Ruben Cannon mm-hmm. was three like th- like three desks down. Right. He got up, walked over, and said, "Hey, you stand up, mm-hmm. turn around." And he was like, "I want you to come back tonight mm. at this theater." Did and you audition yet? No. You were just in line. I was no. I just sat down. Okay. To give him my picture or resume, I just sat yeah. down on gotcha, stage. Got gotcha. you. Got you. Okay. And um. I didn't even audition. I went straight to mm-hmm. where he wanted me to go. Yeah. When I got there, I, that's how I met Spielberg. I did not know uh, who he was. No, I didn't know Spielberg right, you just was saw there. A, a white dude in, <laughs> around. They shoot a black movie, and this is a white guy right here. I didn't even know what the movie was. <laughs> I know I nothing. You. I got you. So I got there, and when I tell you, Spielberg, they I got there late. They was like, "We've been waiting for you." They put me mm-hmm. in the room, mm-hmm. and Spielberg did a acting scene with me. So he's reading with you. He's reading with me. Okay. And the way he did it, he was like, he put the script down. He was like, I want to give you a scene. He was like, pretend you got your sister. Mm -hmm. You're real protective of her. Mm -hmm. And um, we're just going to ad-lib this. And how old were you at this time? I was 12 when I auditioned. Sheesh. Okay. And I said, okay. I do want folks to know the greatness. Mm-hmm. What's, what's At my age. I got you. All right. You know what I'm saying? I was 10 two years ago. Oh, I was I was nine and a half. That's what I'm saying? <laughs> wow, you. I slipped up. <laughs> so right. we went ahead, and when I said Spielberg, was, he was active right yeah. there. And that's how you know he's a great director, because he can actually do both. Yeah, he was right. like, he didn't want to do the script. I've never had an audition where someone did that, even to this day. Yet. Right. And he just did it. Next thing I know, we had, was in there for two hours. Mm-hmm. He asked me to come to Amblin, and it just kept going and kept going. I didn't have an agent. I never had a, I never had auditioned before. Right. I never had anything. Right. All I know is when I got the role... Mm-hmm. My phone was ringing. I know it like, was. I'm a, I bet you had a bunch of cousins you ain't know about too. Man, <laughs> <laughs> that's really you got. Oh, you know I'm your cousin. I you, still get it on social dollar. media. Right. I'd be like, hey, cuz. I'd be like, hmm? gang or or right. Like, oh, what, what, like, what, what, what kind of cuz? <laughs> what cuz? Yeah. What cuz like, we talking about? Right. We talking about wise cuz or uh, uh, cousin cousin <laughs> relative cuz? Right. So I, I right. get it. <laughs> I still get it. Oh, we got we right. cousins. We go way back. I'm like, okay. I hear so, you. Yeah. So, anyway. at what point did you realize the magnitude of the film that you were in, or did I, you? No, <laughs> you did. No. So Don't hold on. Let's no. let's let's just put it into perspective for those who just tuned in, right? Or, or catch it up. You're on the set of Color Purple. Mm-hmm. Steven Spielberg is mm-hmm. directing. Mm-hmm. Oprah, Whoopi mm-hmm. Goldberg, mm-hmm. Danny Glover, everybody. And you just like, oh, I'm just here to do my part. Pretty much. I love it. Let me hit the hype bell for that. <laughs> <laughs> it's a regular Tuesday. <laughs> Pretty. And on top of it, my mother was the kind of mother. She, I had a younger sister. She still mm. expected me to watch them. Mm. So they on came. set? They oh, were yeah, coming yeah. on set? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I was still responsible for my sister. Okay. Um, <laughs> and you got a good, a large I, chunk of the movie is you in the beginning because yes. you're the main character. The movie is centered around Seely. Yes. And yes. you are young Seely before it jumps forward to Whoopi. Yeah. Goldberg. Miss yeah. Goldberg. Yeah, you know, the not, first. And I want to ever say that with much due respect for everything that she's put oh, to yeah, the yeah, yeah, culture yeah. and everything. You know what I mean? But you are, you have this role. Yeah. 
all the way until you get slammed down the steps, basically. Man, yeah. I <clears> mean, <throat> I I freaked out. I was like, you're talking about over th- the first 35 minutes of the movie. Yeah. And when the production started, the first day of filming mm-hmm. of the whole color purple, yeah. that's what I did. I did the, the birth scene Okay. that you saw. Yeah. So I'm on set, and I'm doing this birth scene, and I'm still like, it's just a job, and, yeah. and I'm loving this. So you comb hair, and, it, and you get slapped. And oh, we ain't gonna talk about the slap, but I think you read that. I posted <laughs> the slap see. was real. The slap was real. The slap was. This real. before CGI and all. No. Like, they really <laughs> slapping folks in movies. No, it's like I mean, I will never forget that scene because. Mm-hmm. The only reason why I didn't stop is mm-hmm. because of my training. I was right. taught as Keep never going. stop. Yeah. You never stop. There's no mm-hmm. reason. I mean, for I, I could tell that acting when somebody get hit or when somebody get hit. Yeah. And the way you looked up, you was like, fool. <laughs> Dude, I was like, why? When it got hit for real. I was like, what right. was this? Why? Oh, I kept thinking in my head, like, never, don't stop, don't mm-hmm. stop. But I'm looking at him like, Dude, why? Right. And then I heard Spielberg immediately was like, cut. <laughs> and uh, then he went, he said, did you hit her for real? Uh, <laughs> and, um, and then of course he apologized. Right. And that's just, I never took a nut. Like Danny is not, Danny yeah. is, when I say to you, Danny is such a good friend. He's still, that's he's a amazing. wonderful person. This was just acting. He and was the first celebrity I met just on a whim by accident. And he was just like, he looked, I looked, I was like, he said, yeah, you want a picture? He just asked me. <laughs> I yeah, didn't know. Right, I was right. I was coming out of wars dinner. He was yeah. just walking through the hotel, and I looked and I was like, "That's Danny Glover, just mm-hmm. you know, Atlanta." Yeah. And he yeah. was just like, "Hey, you want a picture?" I was like, "Come on!" I cool. Took a picture and that was it. That was he cool. 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 Super He's cool. cool. Right. Even to this day. <laughs>